So maybe all the news about coronavirus has got you down. Well, that was definitely the case for one makeup artist here in town. So she focused more on her craft and she created something more than good. It's pretty great. Watch. Spaghetti spilled all over a bubble bath. How about some cereal this morning? All of these look real, but it's all makeup. With this COVID-19 happening, I'm not working, so I'm at home. When you get a chance, check out Allison Penn's Instagram page. She's a makeup artist here in the Valley, and she's so good. She's worked on the faces of people like Paula Abdul, Amy Schumer, even Larry Fitzgerald. She decided to do more with makeup after seeing so much disheartening news with COVID-19. And I'm like, you know what? I'm going to paint. I'm going to paint my face. I'm going to make myself happy. It's going to be a choice for me. And it is for everybody. When I decided that the, the point of this was to be happy, the point of all of this for me, um, so I made a list of all the things that make me happy. Literally butterflies, rainbows, wine, like just things, just a list of all the things in life that make me happy. When she's done with her works of art, I go in my bathroom and, you know, with a white wall and just start shooting. And I probably take like 50 pictures of just the right angle and all that, and then choose the best one and throw it up on social. And now these paintings have filled her social media feeds. I've gotten crazy reactions. Like, I'm, it's, I did this for me to keep my spirits up and just to make me happy, but it is making so many other people happy. The comments I'm getting are like, this is the best part of quarantine is looking to see what you're gonna paint the next day. Like I, that to me is so unexpected and that's the part that's making me so much extra happy. <laughs> So Allison uh, was working almost six days a week as a makeup artist before all of this happened. So even uh, she says she still wants to keep doing this when we get back to a regular life. She wants to do it at least one day a week. But here's the funny thing. Her husband, who's also an artist, said he would prefer she do more dishes than she does painting her face. But he's an artist. He's a creative. So he gets it. Uh, and it's also a really good cue to like find something that you really like to do. You never know. Yeah, it might give yeah. you a little dose of happy, especially right now. That would be so fun to go to her and say, hey, paint whatever you want on me. Go for it. Why not? Right? She can come over here anytime. I'll let her in. Uh, tell me the Instagram again. I want to I want to follow her. Oh, it's her name. And we do have a link up on our our, our Facebook, our, our Facebook pages, as well as our website, azfamily.com. I don't know it right off the top of my head, but uh, she's really good. And it's something to kind of browse and check out all the creations that she's done. She's gotten really creative. Cool. Uh, you saw that wine? How cool was yeah. that? I want to see what she did to Larry's face. <laughs> I think it was just a regular makeup job. Okay. <laughs>